Right, Cheltenham Fire Station, Kensham Road. Just come through to the other end of the Sanford Park now. That's the entrance to the Lido swimming pool over there. There's a lot of cars around in the fire station. I've just seen a group of elderly people come out. But whether they're actually doing the, um, the vaccinations here, I don't know. It's certainly... There's no queue anyway. I don't know, I'm looking through the window now and there's, they're not... What's that there? That's the Sanford Education Centre, so I don't know what that is. Whether they're actually using this place. Yeah, go and have a look. Because the fire engines used to be the other side. Off the other road, not here. Yeah, I mean, the people in there, it certainly looks like that's what they're doing. Oh yeah, here we go. Yeah, they've got all the tents in there and... Oh yeah. That's definitely what they're doing in there. They're all sat there waiting in the... on the chairs and the queues. So they are actually doing it, which is nice to know. So sooner or later, folks, they'll be getting through to us. No, a lot of them are medical staff. But I'm in the fifth slot. The under 21s. <laughs> I wish. Oh yeah, here we go. Coronavirus vaccination. Yeah, there's quite a good mix of ages in there, but you never know, do you? They could be medical staff, um, old people's homes, this sort. But it's nice to see it actually happening. No, the other day somebody said it was a Pfizer one here. Yeah, well that, that was what the guy said on when I read it the other day because a lady inquired why haven't I heard I'm 73 and uh, 72 and he was 73 and he said well we're next well there's the entrance guys do you reckon I look 70 do you reckon I get away with it oh, I expect you've got to show your letter yeah I think so yeah you can't just go in off the street they've improved this place that used to be Swanbrook House there. That was uh, where the where the old lady and uh, Swanbrook lived. I used to deliver meat there back in 68, 69. And I had to go up and collect the money off her. Well, as you can see, folks, it's uh, pretty busy. So it's all going on, at least in Cheltenham, which is nice. I suppose it's hard to get it to sink in when they say, you know, there's a population of 68 million. Yeah, you know, it's a lot of people, isn't it? I've, I don't know, anybody, I don't, that used to be a swimming pool, I think. Not ever operative when I was around, but... Did that used to be a swimming pool there? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we used to go there. Well, you, you went there as a kid, though. Yeah. Oh, right. I never did, because obviously it was closed when I got here. But it must have been pre-68. Well, I came here in 68, so... Uh, I, I knew it was, but never seen inside. I saw the Alston Baths. Yeah, so they're actually they're doing what they say they're doing. They're doing the age groups. So that's nice to know. I heard this morning that 30% of the population in New York are refusing to have it done. 
they've been told too many lies or something. Oh yeah, look at that. Merva close, God. I say I haven't been round this way since. I packed in driving cars in '91. These, these were these were built in the '70s and '80s. These, I think, or even maybe the '80s. Oh, I knew somebody lived here. Yeah, I, well, I had a regular customer in there. Well, why are they closed down? Closed, closed. Yeah, you come off a London road, Dan. You're not allowed to turn left at the lights up there, are you? Well, there's obviously a reason. There's no entry anyway up there. We're now coming to a another part, another part of the park where they used to have all the fairs and everything in the summertime when I was a youngster. And the big. Uh, mound in front of us was a, <laughs> a a flood deterrent the year they finished it 2007 we had the worst floods in Charlton we'd ever had and it lasted for weeks and that was supposed to stop it but it didn't that's right yeah it comes off London Road Yeah, I don't know why. Anyway, here we are, folks. This is... That used to be flat over there, and then they put that mound of earth there, and it's done nothing, basically. Biggest waste of money. I've got a feeling somebody said it was 13 million. I might be wrong. But, uh, again... There's a park, oh, it's not as crowded as the London ones, but there's still a lot of people. <laughs> 